Hello my friends, thank you for joining me today. I've come out to Moyle Van Ley. Now uh, it's quite windy, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get the drone out again today, but there we go, that's what happens sometimes. Um, we'll take a look, it's some nice clouds, very windy as I say, you can probably hear that, I hope you can hear me, should be okay, the mic on. Um, but we've got some lovely light and some lovely low cloud. It's not due to rain, but it's going to be cloudy with bright patches. So hopefully with a bit of luck, that should be very good for us to uh, maybe get a few photos. Um, at the top, we've got the Jubilee Tower. Um, there should be a notice board like the ones behind me up there showing you how originally they estimated it used to look. If it is still there, I will show you obviously later on in the uh, vlog. So, not sure how much there is to photograph on the way up, but we'll have a look anyway. So, um, I suggest we just get going. Okay then, so let's go and find out what we can see. Come on then. Right, so we're on the path up, and uh, just sort of stop to show you some views, because it's absolutely beautiful out there. I don't know if you're picking up down there, you can see the wind turbines on the coast. Uh, that's from more or less my, my neck of the woods, Prostate. But you've got a lovely light being thrown across the landscape over here. Um, it's sort of early afternoon. So, uh, yeah. Uh, hopefully there's one or two sunbeams, or god rays as some people call them, coming through the clouds after. That would be quite nice to try and capture. Uh, I've taken one or two pictures. Uh, I'll put them up, obviously, for you to see. So I just wanted to stop and show you this here. So anyway, I think it's time to move on. So come on, let's go. Okay, so I'm setting up a shot here now because what I like about this shot we've got a nice leading line of the wall going up there. You've got the marker post for the actual um, Moyle Van Wey summit up there which is in view here and we've got a lovely mist, I suppose you'd call it that, rolling across the, uh, the top there going from left to right. Uh, quite atmospheric really and you've got the path of course leading up to it. So this is on ISO 100, on about F10, with a bit of depth of field, it's going to be one shot, and it's about an eighth of a second. So uh, I'm going to take the shot and see how it works out, and if it's any good I'll put it up for you obviously later. There we go, just taking that now, have a quick nose it, do a bit of glitching, as you can do of course in landscape. Yeah, it seems okay in camera. So um, yeah. There's a nice little bit of low mist hovering above the forest over here. You can see maybe, I hope you can see anyway behind me looking down the coast, this low cloud. Uh, we've got a thick band of cloud on the top. What I've also done here is put a graduated uh, F9, uh, sorry F9, a graduated 0.9 soft grad on top just to help with the uh, brightness of the sky to bring that down a little bit. So um, yeah, it looks quite good. Anyway, let's make our way to the top, shall we? And I'll pick you up again later on up there. Okay.
lovely day. So I've reached the top of the Jubilee Tower now. It's, I am hand holding the camera because it's extremely exposed and very windy. Um, and also I'm just going to take you around and show you around because you've got a 360 panoramic view here but the mist is fantastic just rolling past so I'll just spin you around and uh, bear with me on this one. Okay so this is the actual top you can see down there whew, getting blown it. The uh, trick point, holy moly. Ah, right, so it's cleared up a little bit. Right, down there you can see, and I'm gonna zoom in, I hope you can see at least. That is Padeswood Tunnel Cement Works near Mould. Holy golly. And over there, if you can pick out, just in the, where the sun is shining through, you've got Flincher Bridge zooming in a bit for you hope you can see it I think you're picking up this wind but look at this mist rolling it's beautiful unfortunately I haven't got much of a view to show you um, but it's, it's hopefully good enough anyway Kilkin's down there that's where I'm heading after just to say hello to the in-laws and the Sun is shining and look at the beautiful light it's, it's throwing up but if you look over by the coast, how fabulous is that? You've got the wind turbines, or so in my neck of the woods, I hope it's focusing, I don't know. But you've got a very thick band of clouds sat just right on top. Spin you around here. Uh, sun rays are trying to get through. Just gonna stand up on this one. I've left my camera down there. A little bit of shelter. You've got some uh, information things here which I've already uh, taken a few photos of. But as I move around there, I just like the way that path, if you can see, is being lit up because you've got the puddles from all the rain. And when the sun catches it, it just lights up. There you go, see what I mean? Well, the sun's not on it yet, I do realise that. But look at that. Fantastic. Okay then. Uh, I might stop, I've seen one or two th compositions that might work on the way down if so. The other thing is of course I'm walking towards where the sun's setting. So I'm just looking at those clouds move over there. you got the thin misted ones in the foreground here going, you've got a little bit of mist hovering on top of the forest there. But on the top of that hill you can see the white cloud and dark cloud just moving across there now. It's a beautiful sight. Right, and look at that, it's cleared again all of a sudden down there. Wow. Whew, what a day, eh? Okay, so I'm going to move down again and um, see what we can pick up down there and I'll speak to you again there. Okie dokie, and we'll see you soon. <clears throat> okay so I made it back to the car um, wow it's been uh, blustery um, it's going to be a short vlog probably this one um, because I haven't been able to get my drone out believe it or not I don't know about you but it said 16 miles an hour wind yeah right um, you can judge that for yourself I'm no expert but that seemed a little bit of more than 16 miles an hour and I didn't want to lose my drone so um, forget it. I'll get it out sometime for you and be able to do some uh, aerial footage as well but until then it, it's, uh, it is what it is as they say. <laughs> uh, I hope you enjoyed the video anyway the vlog uh, please subscribe to me give me a like leave a comment okay um, as you know, I keep saying I am new to it. I think this I might be going into double figures now Ooh, in uh, videos. So I might have 11 videos out or vlogs, whatever. 
So, um, this is going to be the last vlog before Christmas uh, due to work commitments. Um, so, um, I will try and be out again in the new year, or I'll definitely be out with some new locations. Fingers crossed, we'll have to get the drone out, who knows? <laughs> um, so, with that in mind, I'd like to wish each and every one of you a very happy Christmas and a very merry new year as well. Um, yeah, so that's that's it really. Nothing much more to say or do. Um, please stay safe, have fun over Christmas. And uh, if you want to see more of my photographs, you can uh, tune in to my uh, on Facebook pages. It's Mark Pierce Photography Gallery. That's the main one because they're singular shots. They're my favourites. Um, and then there's Mark Pierce Photography Snapshots. Self-explanatory really, isn't it? Um, I don't very rarely throw photos away unless they're out of focus or blurred or... But yeah, same thing, isn't it? Or, uh, you know, or very samey, if you like. Uh, this gives people a catalogue to have a look. So you can uh, tune in, Mark Pierce Photography Snapshots. Have a look. Okay, I'm not asking you to like or follow it or what have you. But take a look. If you do, that would be brilliant. Um, but the gallery is the, the main one, they're the, what I class as the better shots. I sold images off both and I'm not, I'm not trying to sell images as well, please don't think that. I'm just saying, have a look, okay? Because not all the photographs I take appear on these vlogs, so, yeah. Anyway, um, that'll do for now. I'm trying to shade, as you can see. Oh, wow, yeah, the sun is really strong. It's nearly, uh, nearly uh, there, isn't it, the sunset? So once again, happy Christmas to everybody and New Year. Thank you for tuning in. For those who have stayed, please, as I say, give us a like, maybe subscribe. That'll be even better. And until next time, happy days. Take care. See you next time. Bye-bye.